Jake Gyllenhaal in the new Southpaw trailer. Oh my gosh, you guys, he is beefed out. It doesn't even look like the Jake Gyllenhaal that we recently saw in Nightcrawler. Definitely underwent some sort of massive transformation. I want you guys to check out the trailer. The more you get hit, the harder you fight. I get it. Let's go! Only now you've taken way too many hits hey. before you get off. You can't fight like that anymore. Think about her. I don't want to tell you something. I love you. I love you. <laughs> so predictable. Man. That is quite the transformation. Uh, we recently talked about Chris Pratt and his transformation for Guardians of the Galaxy. Now Ooh. we're definitely seeing it with Jake Gyllenhaal, who has the better transformation. But first thoughts, five words or less. Chris, you're pretty prathetic. Ooh. It's too much sexy. Where's Jake? Hello, jacked Gyllenhaal. What? <laughs> good boy. That, that was, was kind of really good, good, actually. <laughs> Dang it. All right, so do you guys, uh, does this movie, aside from his transformation, because that takes a lot of commitment, a lot of work, a lot of work ethic to do that workout and lose the weight and look as ripped as he is, but do you guys think that the movie looks good? First of all, talking about his transformation, it is an amazing transformation, and he does deserve credit, because did you guys see the movie Nightcrawler? I and what he looked like? But I saw, yeah. Have you I know seen the, the movie? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He doesn't look like this. He doesn't look like uh, jacked. I am very excited to see it. Uh, I I enjoy movies like this. I, I like the movie The Fighter, mm -hmm. which was with uh, Christian Bale and Mark Wahlberg, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. um, so I like these kind of stories of adversity and and um, sports so when it's tied in together. I I'll definitely. I mean, the trailer looks good to mm -hmm. me. Yeah, and Rachel I, McAdams yeah. is in and it. Rachel McAdams. He almost great. looks as sexy as uh, Mickey Rourke in The Wrestler. <laughs> Almost. Ow! Yeah. Ow! Oh, you like that, Brett? You um, like it? Yeah, see, this is one of those trailers where I can't tell if it's going to be good or the worst thing I've ever seen. It's just, it's, and it's one of those trailers that tells you everything. That's what pissed me off. It happens. Yeah, I don't I know if I like, needed to know Rachel McAdams was going to die, right? Thank you. Yeah. If you watch the trailer, you learn every, you learn very quickly that he's lost pretty much everything in his life, and that's why he's so desperate mm -hmm. right. to try to become this fighter again. And like his life is on the line because of it. We learn all of that in the trailer. Yeah, I yeah. don't know. I and then this the actors in it. Jake Gyllenhaal isn't one of those those Christian Bale actors. Mm -hmm. Like, and and it's not his fault. But he's in this movie with him and Rachel McAdams and Fifty Cent. Yeah. It just it feels like a lower tier of movie for some reason to me. I mean, Jake Gyllenhaal is a very talented actor. I think that he could definitely kill it. I disagree with you. I disagree. Uh -oh. with My you. girlfriend wants to have intercourse with him so bad. <laughs> so maybe you have a bias. Maybe? I'm just hoping there's enough blood and swelling on his face where, she, like, that'll counteract how gorgeous every muscle in his body is. So we're gonna do a little pop trigger mm, award show. Ooh. With one category. With one category. Okay, because we, we recently did a whole segment on Chris Pratt's transformation, which was really cool because he transformed, he lost like 60 pounds to be, you know, this superhero in Guardians of the Galaxy. And it does take a lot of work ethic. I mean, these guys are Absolutely. training twice a day. I don't know how many hours a day, but twice a day. And they have these strict diets and they're doing everything they can to embody these characters. And they, they deserve props for it, whether or not that you like their, their acting chops or the movies or whatnot. Yeah. So, best transformation, Chris Pratt versus... Jake Gyllenhaal, I want to hear your answers and then we're going to toss it to our audience. Well, first of all, I do not think, Chris Pratt, you are pathetic or prathetic. Just, right. You know, I use that as a joke, mm -hmm. so please don't get Aww. offended. I know you'll be watching, so maybe your feelings <laughs> were hurt. Um, so I nice didn't you. see that movie. You didn't? It's Pratt. good. I want to oh, see it. Yeah. Um, it's really hard to see movies because I fall asleep around 5 p.m. Yeah. 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 You do that. Um, but I did see the trailer for okay. Jake Gyllenhaal, and I did really like how many abs he had. So, so you're going with Jake. <laughs> I'm going Jake. Okay, yeah, Jake. I'm going Jake. Um, the answer is Chris Pratt, and I'll what? tell you why. Because, like, Jake Gyllenhaal as sexy, ripped dude, like, we've seen that, Prince of Persia. Oh. Like, we've seen that jarhead. Oh. Right? Chris so you're Pratt. holding it against him that he. Can yes, get and I'll back tell you why. Form? As someone who's been there, going back, I think is probably easier than yeah. someone who has never, ever been someone, there. You've been there before, huh? I, see, I've been jacked, <laughs> as evidenced by this photo that was done, taken, not photoshopped. <laughs> Here's a challenge. I think they'll just cut this whole section out because they're like, yeah. I can't make Brett look buff. I, There's no way. I, I actually agree with you because muscle memory. I know, like, if I do, like, one thing of yoga, because I used to be a lot buffer when I used to swim, if I do, like, one hour of yoga, right. my muscles are, like, popping. So I definitely think that for Jake, it was much easier than it was for Chris. I may so have I'm said going this. Chris Pratt. 
I may have said this before, but I never meant it as much as I do now. I hate you. Why? Because you can, your body remembers everything. You and your, you and your hours and hours in the pool of working and yeah. making, you know. It's a pretty, yeah. sorry. So you guys, please vote for Chris Pratt or for Jake Gyllenhaal for our one uh, category award show that Amir decided would be a good idea. And I love it. We'll call it the Pop Trigger Amir Awards. <laughs> Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, the, <laughs> yes, we're going to stick Amis. with that. The Ammies. The Ammies. We love you guys. Please uh, also share your thoughts in the comment section below, and we'll see you guys all next time on Pop Trigger. <laughs>